Alright guys, so a few hours ago, we got the official Dokkan V-Jump scan from DBS Hype on Twitter, so a big shout out and thank you to him for making this available to us. And uh, it's basically all about the upcoming Dragon Ball Heroes collab that both Global and JP will be getting later this month. So without further ado, let's uh, jump right into it and see what's going on, starting with the new summonable characters. There will be five in total. And we have, uh, starting from the left here, the Limit Breaker or Limit Broken Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, Limit Breaker Super Saiyan 4 Goku, uh, Super Hearts, uh, my personal favorite, Golden Metal Cooler, and then also uh, this one is apparently Reconstructed Janemba, which uh, I wasn't super familiar with, but he looks pretty cool. Uh, but dude, Golden Cooler, Golden Metal Cooler looks absolutely amazing. So, of these five, I gotta say, he's probably the one that I'm the most excited for. But yeah, they all look good, especially the uh, Cooler and the Super Saiyan 4s. I was kind of hoping that there would be a Super Saiyan 4 Limit Breaker Gogeta or a Vegito, but uh, it doesn't seem like that's gonna happen unless there's gonna be a secret fifth unit that they're withholding from this scan, which is possible, I guess. So um, I don't think that our hopes of getting a fusion for this collab is, you know, dead by any means. But right now, all we know is that these are the five new summonable units. The Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta, the Super Hearts, the Reconstructed Janemba, and also the Golden Metal Cooler. So from there, we have some info for the uh, new free-to-play unit, which is this Lags right here. There's her SSR form, and then the TUR as well. And uh, on the left side, we have three event announcements. The first one is an Extreme Z area for uh, basically all of the free-to-play heroes units. We got the uh, uh, Cumber in the back, and then we have Oms, uh, Great Saiyan Man 4, uh, Demon God Salsa, as well as Demon Goddess Poutine. And then after that, we have an Extreme Z battle event for apparently eight uh, heroes Extreme Z Awakenings. Four of them are revealed here, and then the other four are currently unknown. But uh, the four we see here are the Xeno Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, and also the Super Saiyan Cumber slash Great Ape Cumber and Super Fu. And then at the very bottom, at the very bottom here, we have an announcement for a new red zone event specifically with uh, Dragon Ball Heroes characters. So yeah, Dragon Ball Heroes red zone is also coming along with this celebration. And uh, I think that's basically everything that was revealed here. Um, yeah, so five summonable units, maybe one more, maybe a secret one, maybe Limit Breaker, Gogeta, or Vegito, who knows. Here's the hoping. And uh, also three events with a bunch of Extreme Z Awakenings, um, at least five free to play ones, as well as eight summonable Extreme Z Awakenings, uh, Heroes Red Zone, and also Legs as the free to play unit. And uh, yeah, that's basically all there is to talk about, guys. Uh, let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about the reveals for your new events, but also especially the characters themselves. Um, I do think that. This is a really good selection. Um, the only thing that's missing, of course, is a fusion, which uh, once again, I'm still holding out hope for. Um, if it doesn't happen, then, you know, it is what it is, but uh, I'm really hoping that it does. And uh, as far as the other four Extreme Z Awakenings go, did they announce the EZAs for some of these Super Saiyan 4s? Or no, that's just the Dokkan Awakenings, right? For the. Um, Bardock and the uh, Trunk, no, sorry, um, the Super Saiyan 4 Gohan, Super Saiyan 4 Gohan and Bardock. So, yeah, those guys are getting Dokkan Awakenings. Um, I'm guessing maybe Extreme Z Awakenings are a little bit too soon for this year, but that's also a possibility. It'd be really cool if some of these Super Saiyan 4s, especially like Super Saiyan 4 Vegito, got an Extreme Z Awakening because, I mean, while they're still decent, they could definitely benefit from EZAs. So, yeah, we'll see about the other four, but um, everything so far looks very, very solid. Um, I like what I see. I think this will be 
possibly the best Heroes collab so far. Um, the Red Zone event is actually really, really exciting, so can't wait to see what that looks like. And uh, yeah, it's just all looking really, really dope. So uh, yeah, that's all I gotta say, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, give me your opinions in the comments, and uh, once we get more info about anything else, you know, the details for the characters, the animations, um, you know, details for the events and all that stuff, I'll make sure to keep you guys posted in a future video, but that's all I gotta say for now, thank you so much for watching, and uh, as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video, sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content, and until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger, with Tiger Uppercut Video, signing out.